Hey everybody, Notorious here. Welcome back to my channel. In this episode, I'm going to quickly demonstrate a midline method for creating mechanical advantage on a limb walk. Um, a lot of you are probably familiar with it already. It's called the SCAM, S-C-A-M, it's an acronym. And yeah, let me demonstrate it. So first step is put your lanyard on, get yourself safe and secure, and then you can unweight your system and pull out some slack. And the next step is to take either a carabiner, a carabiner with a pulley on it, or a pulley beaner like this, a uh, pulley affixed to a carabiner like this. Um, this is the revolver rig, and this is probably the best option, but you can use all of the aforementioned. So first step is to take the revolver rig and put it on the rope. Then you're going to create a munter. I'm tying this really low on my line because I want it to be in frame in the camera, but in real life, you would want to make this as high up on your line as you can possibly reach. And then again, like I said, create a munter by going around the rope like so. And finally, I like to go around one last half turn like that. And then I pull this strand through the revolver rig. The final step is to take either a carabiner, another pulley beaner like this, or a carabiner with a pulley on it. And I'm using the ladder. So here I've got my carabiner with a pulley on it. And this will help give me more mechanical advantage and make the system have less friction. So I'm running this on my second bridge. You can also do it on your hip D or one of your lower Ds if you want. You just need to capture that strand somehow onto your harness. All right. And now you've created a three to one system and it's not a true three to one because it's not that efficient because there is, you know, at each pulley probably about 30% loss. And um, yeah, it's just, that's how it is. Uh, but it's better than if you were to do a limb walk and try to come back on just the one line. Um, it's so much easier because you have, you do have mechanical advantage. Um, so the next step is to weight the system and take your lanyard off and then we're going to do our limb walk if i wanted to go back in towards my tying point all i have to do is pull on the strand above my device like this and as you move in you keep tending slack that way if you fall back you'll get caught so you can keep going in and tend your slack all right so let's say you want to go to the end of a limb and then do a redirect you're not going to be able to do that with this three to one setup so here's what you do. This system is retrievable. So you do, you do not need to go back to the carabiner, carabiner with a pulley or pulley beaner to undo the system. And I'll show you how you can get that back at the end of a limb log. All right, so we've got that up there. We're gonna put our lanyard on again unweight the system, take this pulley off, and stow that on our harness, and then you're just going to 
release this strand here and watch what happens. The thing will come back to you, whatever you use. It'll go right down the rope and go right to you. So that's pretty cool. Um, then let's take up all that slack. You're back in business. Now you can do your redirect and do work on another part of the tree. All right, thanks so much for watching. This has been the SCAM Midline Producible Mechanical Advantage for Limb Walks. And it's retrievable. So this is probably my favorite system for mechanical advantage on a limb walk, hands down. Um, it's extremely well thought out and extremely effective. I've never had it not work. So check it out. I think you'll like it. And be sure to check out my channel for more hitch how-tos, not tutorials, and climbing videos. Please subscribe. Take care.